When winter weather gets bad, the roads are clearly impacted. Chris Kudrowski tells us about the decision to shut down highways. 994, uh, we feared this was going to happen, but uh, the interstate is now closed. When snow Glen falls and, and the wind blows, it can make for hazardous driving conditions on North Dakota highways and interstates. When road conditions become too dangerous for drivers, the North Dakota Highway Patrol works together with the North Dakota Department of Transportation to make the decision to close. From the highway patrol officers to the plow drivers and maintenance supervisors, the planning and decision making to stop traffic is a team. Effort. It's constantly a joint decision, and when we make that decision to um, for a closure, whether it's you know one in one specific area, um, it's done so uh, through a lot of communication. And all of these closures region wide are going to remain in effect overnight. Each Notice storm is different and unique in how it begins and western. progresses. So the North Dakota Highway Patrol and North Dakota Department of Transportation use several different criteria to monitor not only the road conditions but visibility as well. But the, the coordinated ones um, with DOT are typically, uh, you know, ice related, heavy snowfall, visibility, or a combination thereof. Lieutenant Derek Arndt says they use all the information available to them during bad weather, but when it's time to make the call, the best information they have are from their patrol officers in the elements. I'm talking to our troopers out on the road. Um, they're talking to the plows. So you get real first-hand knowledge of what's going on out there. This winter season has already seen record-breaking snowfall and cold temperatures to create perilous travel, vehicles sliding into the ditch or semis jackknifed on the roads. Lieutenant Arndt said the North Dakota Highway Patrol has cameras so the public can see the road conditions in real time, but even those can be deceptive. He says to check the road maps and take travel advisories seriously. In Bismarck, I'm Krista Kidrowski reporting for your news leader.